In the Old Testament book of Genesis, the Bible tells us the Lord God said it's not good that the man should be alone. I will make a help meet for him. And then it goes on to say, For this cause shall a man leave his father and mother and shall cleave unto his wife, and they shall be one flesh. To both of you, let me say that real love is laying down your lives for one another. It's an expression of your thoughts, your feelings, and your desires as one. Love makes burdens lighter because you divide them. It makes joys more intense because you share them. And we honor and, and rejoice with you now as we witness your vows and love to one another in this blessed estate of marriage. Never did believe what I couldn't see long before I knew, darling. I Took a train downtown, gave us time to talk about the things that we could do, darling. I was made for you. Oh, I was made for you. Oh. You, Katie, take this man whom you hold by the hand to live together in marriage. Will you love him, comfort him, honor and keep him in sickness and in health, in prosperity and in adversity, and forsaking all others to be faithful to him so long as you shall live? I do. Will you, Josh, take this woman whom you hold by the hand? I do. One thing that is true. I, Katie, take you, Josh, to be my husband. I, Josh, take you, Katie, to be my wife. I promise to always stand by your side. As your partner, your lover, and your best friend. I give you all my trust. I give you all my trust and my tomorrows. I promise I will always cherish you. And I promise my love for you is forever. And I promise my love for you is forever. <laughs> Darling, I was made for you. Oh.